Welcome you guys to ztutorials.tk and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a live CD with Ubuntu or it can be used with any other one like Kubuntu and all them which is basically just an operating system that provides free software and all that good stuff a really really good alternative to Windows and Mac so basically all you do is you go to ubuntu.com you click on either your desktop or your notebook download and notebook being 10 or 11 inch the smaller screens um, but I have a desktop so I'm going to click ahead on desktop and click on download now basically you do need a CD or you do need a USB stick for this so you just click your operating system I have a 64 bit if you're 32 bit pick, please pick that if you have a USB pick USB I have a CD if you're Windows, Mac or Ubuntu, I'm a Windows and basically gives you some steps there but we won't need them you just click on away on start download and it'll start downloading there and we just skip ahead there a bit till it's almost done um, it's about 700 MB just under it so make sure you have a CD or a USB that'll hold 700 MB uh, most of them do so you shouldn't have a problem there so you just open that up in its folder um, you see where it is you just drag and drop that to the desktop so you'll have it easily found and basically just download another program called infra recording I -N -F -R -A, recorder um, that's in the description as well download that you will need that to write it to your CD and you just click you're going to be writing the image the image is what you just downloaded there um, into your CD so make sure you put in your CD right now um, as you can see it just showed up there CDRW and you just click on the little icon there that says write the contents of this disk image to the CD and wherever you saved it I presume you saved it to the desktop so find it Ubuntu 10.04 and you just look at this make sure that you all of them are okay, you don't want simulation write speed maximum obviously write method, yeah that's grand make sure your drive is there if it's not refresh the drive etc, click ok now my CD isn't empty, yours probably will be if it isn't, and if it's an RW just delete it um, it'll erase the disk there now for me and basically when that's done it'll start burning the image and it'll start burning there. I'm just going to skip ahead there a bit till it's almost done. It's at one percent now. And I'll skip ahead. It'll take about. I think it takes around twenty-five minutes. Depends on your drive, obviously. Okay. And that's it. I'm just going to eject the disk there now, um, and put it back in. So while I do that, I'll just tell you about. Uh, my website ztutorials.tk if you want to see that it's got the most up to date news um, all my videos straight up to date all the downloads um, like Camtasia, Dreamweaver all that good stuff my video tutorials you can contact me some reviews are there as well um, I also have a Dreamweaver tutorial how to create a website and for free of course upload it to the web and everything um, loads of videos there's more to come so we're just gonna click down in and it clicks DVDRWF drive install Ubuntu and basically all you have to do is you just go to start and you go to restart and my other video tutorial will pick up where that left off so subscribe if you liked it and uh, comment below brought to you by Z Tutorials.